Hi, Aries. Welcome to your reading. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is going to be an end of the year prediction. So anything that may happen from now to the end of the year will be coming out in this reading. Keep in mind, these predictions are general. So feel free to you know, um, assign it to any area of your life you feel it's talking about or resonating with, okay? All right, so let's see what we have for Aries. What can Aries expect um, from now to the end of the year? What can Aries expect from now until the end of the year, spirit? Aries. What can Aries expect from now to the end of the year? Okay, Aries. So we do have the Ten of Coins. Um, so this is really good, Aries. It feels like you're on the road to the riches, okay? You're on the road to stability, security, okay? I feel like, you know, this could have to do uh, definitely about, like, your career, Okay. Or whatever you're working towards right now. Okay. I'm hearing something about retirement. You could be working towards like early retirement or financial freedom or something like that. You know, this could even be within your business. You know, you really are hoping to see success, not just in a short term, but in the long term. And that's good because Spirit is saying you're on the road to that. Okay. By the end of the year, you will feel very secure and stable. And as though, you know, um, you have a long-term plan or you have a long-term um, stability here, okay? What can Aries expect from now to the end of the year? What can Aries expect from now to the end of the year? <clears throat> okay, so that's what I'm getting. You do have the Empress, okay? So this could even be happening like within... Uh, a state of family situation. <clears throat> Some of you, maybe you've been hoping to be able to take care of your parents, or maybe you're hoping that your parents' financial situation improves or something like that. This could have to do with family. If you're hoping that your family situation would be healed or, um, you know, be stable, then that is what's also showing, you know, family will be blessed and stable. Okay. I do feel like some of you, you're, you could be concerned concerned about your mother. Um, for others of you, I'm getting that maybe you could already be a mother, okay? And you want security for your children. Um, I'm seeing that you are going to be very abundant through business, through career, through job, whatever it is. You know, abundance is all your path, so you have nothing to worry about. For my men out there, if you have a wife or a family, um, I feel like you could be meeting your wife, the person that you could marry by the end of the year, okay? Or Aries and whatever, women or men out there, you could be meeting this person that you're meant to marry by the end of the year, okay? Um, now, if you're some of you, I'm getting, you could be pregnant or you could be on the road to getting pregnant. That could be what you're wanting for some of you. Um, if that's the case, then Spirit is saying you're going to have success in achieving that by the end of this year. Um, if you are currently pregnant, it is showing stability and security for you financially. So you won't have to be stressed about anything when it comes to um, taking care of your child, okay, or whatever the case may be, your children. This is really good. I am also, I'm strongly getting something about business though. So by the end of the year, you're going to find that, wow, my business is skyrocketing. My business, you have complete like faith in your business. Okay. Or if you're even starting a business from now to the end of the year, it's going to be lucrative. Okay. You're going to experience a lot of growth. Um, I feel like within your relationship or within your career. Okay. Okay. What can Aries expect from now to the end of the year? What can Aries expect from now to the end of the year? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> we have Ten of Swords at the bottom of the deck. So it's all about money for you. It's all about security, literally, Aries, you know. <laughs> you know, this is really, really, really good. Uh, a really good sign for you. Okay. Okay. Some of you are getting a lump sum of money or you're seeing an increase in your business, in your money, your finances. 
okay? Or maybe you could be um, receiving an opportunity that uh, the blessing and the opportunity of abundance through a new job, okay? Through a raise, through, like I said, an inheritance or anything like that. And for others of you that are relationship-minded, you could be, like I said, this could be indicating pregnancy or um, a successful long-term relationship that's coming towards you or that's already in your life, okay? But the name of the game for you from now to the end of the year, Aries, is growth, okay? What's happening for Aries for now, from now to the end of the year? What's happening? Oh my God, all these pentacles. You have the seven of pentacles <clears throat> and the lovers. So you could be connecting with a Taurus, a Libra, a Gemini. Okay, but it looks like uh, Aries that, you know, this could definitely be speaking about partnership for some of you. Like you're finding that relationship that you could, like the person that you could be married to, okay, um, that you could get married to. Like whoever this person is that, that's around you from now to the end of the year, there's strong potential for marriage, a long-term union. Okay, maybe you see this as a twin flame connection, but this is a significant partnership for some of you, okay? So you don't have to worry if you're hoping, you know, to find or to meet your spouse. Well, then you're in luck. Okay, you guys are really lucky with this with this kind of pool, okay? Um, or if you're already currently in a relationship, you're just going to keep experiencing growth, Okay. And maybe you guys are discussing, you know, uh, long-term plans and, you know, um, bringing children into the mix or whatever the case may be. Okay. This is wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Okay. So all you need to do, Aries, is to continue to just receive this abundance. There's nothing else really required. Receive it, honey. Okay. And nurture it, right? Be patient with yourself. Um, okay. Just understand it may not be an overnight thing for some of you who just started like your business. But just understand by the end of the year, you will have complete faith in it though. Okay. That it's going to turn out for the best. All right. What do you want Aries to know from now to the end of the year? We already have yes flying out. So spirit really wants you to know, yes, yes. Don't cry. Whatever you're wondering or you're worried about, um, spirit is telling you yes. Okay. You have the situation will improve. Okay. So you have nothing to worry about, honey. <clears throat> You know, it will go in your favor. Okay. The lovers. Okay. So let's pull you some guidance cards here, Aries. What do you want Aries to know, please? You are at the end of a cycle in your life. Call upon your angels to comfort you and to guide you to your next step. Happiness awaits you now. You deserve the best. Reach for the stars with your dreams and goals and desires. Don't compromise. You are a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon the earth and all of its inhabitants. Okay. You have an important life purpose involving communication. Okay. And the arts or, or the arts. Please don't allow insecurities to hold you back. I will help you. Okay. So I hope you found this helpful, Aries. If you like to see more of these kind of predictions, let me know by hitting the like button. Okay. I love you all. Thank you for being here with me and talk to you soon.